Hello! Welcome to this week's Happy Camper DIY craft video. I'm Miss Jen and today we're going to make fish wind socks. If you registered for the craft today, you should have picked up your supplies at the youth service desk at the library. And if not, I'll show you in a minute all the supplies we need if you want to join us at home. Okay, so in your supply bag, you should have gotten a large piece of blue paper, some blue streamers, a blue strip of paper, and a baggie that has some colorful fish, some white circle stickers, a glue stick, and googly eyes. The first step is to glue down the fish on the blue paper. First, I'm going to arrange my fish. They can face either way. I want to stay away from the ends because that's where we'll glue our paper together to make the cylinder for the windsock. So let's try to keep the fish towards the middle. Okay, that looks good. Now I'm just going to put a decent amount of glue on the back. Don't forget the little tail and stick them down. Okay, all my fish are glued down. The next step is to take out the eyes and glue one eye to each fish. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we're gonna let these fish dry and the eyes dry. And while we do that, we can take the white circle stickers and use them to show little bubbles coming out of their mouth and you can do whatever kind of pattern you'd like to show these fish bubbles. You might have extra and that's okay. I think I'm just gonna put one more and that's enough fish bubbles for me. Okay, so now our fish are done and our next step is to get our blue streamers and flip our paper upside down, turn it around, and at the bottom, we're going to glue these streamers next to each other. This is the windsock part that will move in the wind. So I'm going to put a little bit of glue at the bottom here. Kind of like to make a straight line stop right there and just start gluing right next to each other. Press it down nice and firm. Put them close enough to each other so that you can use as many as you can. You might have one or two extra when you're done and that's okay. One, two, three, four, five. Keep going here with some more glue along the bottom. Okay, that's all the streamers I had in my bag. So I'm gonna let this dry for a minute so that none of these streamers fall off when I do the next step. All right, my streamers have dried. I'm still on the back and here is the next step. We're going to flip him back over just for a minute. Look at all that fun blue streamer at the bottom. You're going to pick a side and put glue on one side all the way down, just to one side and we're going to glue this paper together to make a big cylinder. After I put the glue on, I'm going to carefully close it up. When the fish are glued down, it makes it a little bit tricky. There we go. Let's close it up and press down. You can even press down in the middle if you can. 
Let's hold it here for about a minute. I'm gonna put my hand inside and press it down here so that the windsock doesn't open up. Let's give it a few seconds here. Till it's nice and dry. Okay, so my windsock is all dry and it looks great. There's just one more step. We need a handle so we can hold on to it and run around. So with your last strip of paper, put some glue on one side and some on the other side. And then you're going to attach it to the top of your windsock to make a nice handle to hold on to. Push it down for a few seconds there. And press it down here for a few seconds. and we should be ready to test it out. Here it is. Hope you had fun.